In this video, I will be showing you how to install the Progress Data Direct ODBC SQL Server driver on Windows 64-bit. Note this driver is also available for 32-bit applications. First, we're going to right-click on the file you downloaded and extract it. Next, we're going to open the resulting folder, right-click on the installation file, and choose Run as Administrator. Click Next, accept the license agreement. We're going to select the default installation location, and we'll do an evaluation installation. We'll select the driver to be evaluated, in this case, our SQL Server driver. And then we'll click Next and Install. We'll click Done, and that completes the installation. To test the installation, we're going to create a data source connection to a local SQL Server. To start, we'll go to our Start menu, and we'll open ODBC Administrator. Here, we'll click on System DSN and Add. We'll choose the driver that we just installed, the DataDirect 8.0 SQL Server Wire Protocol driver. Click Finish. We'll name our data source. We'll put in the host name. In this case, it's local to the machine. We're going to put in our database name as well. We will click Test Connect and put in credentials to the database. See, we've successfully connected. Click OK and OK. To test our connection to the database, we're going to use the example application that was installed with the driver. This is located on your C drive in Program Files, Progress, Data Direct, ODBC 8.0, Samples, and Example. We'll double click on the example application, which will open a command prompt window. Here, we'll type in our data source name that we created in the prior step, as well as the credentials for the database user. You'll see several warnings that it's changed the database context and language. We can now issue a SQL statement. Here you'll see data being returned from the database. And just like that, you've established connectivity to your SQL Server database using the Progress Data Direct SQL Server ODBC driver.